Kamusta Kaim Lahat. Today I'm going to be teaching all of you how to make some simple sinigang. So what you need for sinigang is some meat. So right now I'm using pork, but you can use fish. And, or you can have no meat. You can have like a vegetable sinigang if you want. So you have some potatoes, some onion, tomato, some spicy peppers. Um, I'm here in the U.S. so I have bok choy as like my greens, but you can also use spinach or any kind of like greenery thing. Some beans, fish sauce, oil, and your sinigun mix, which you can pick up at like any Asian market usually in your area. And yeah, and you can also, in the Philippines, you can add um, squash and okra yeah you can add pretty much any kind of vegetable you want into it all right so you take your pan heat it up add your oil to the pan all right go ahead and add your onions to the pan hot Crisp up for a little bit. Alright, go ahead and add your pork. Alright, add a little salt and pepper and stir it in. Alright, once your pork is cooked, not all the way, but like halfway through, go ahead and add water into the mix. So once you have full water, you go ahead and add your potatoes. And your tomatoes. And your chili peppers. Also add some fish sauce. Alright, once this has started boiling, go ahead and add some green beans or sea cow. All right, once your ingredients have been boiling for about 15 minutes, add your bok choy. Let that cook for another 10 minutes. All right, after about 10 minutes, go ahead and add your sinigang mix. Depends on how big your pot is, if you need to add one or two, just taste it and don't decide. All right, once you add your stuff, put it over some rice, put it in a bowl, and enjoy it.